it's when two or more health and social care professionals learn with, from and about each other to improve interprofessional collaboration and quality of health care. Learning a lot more um, information about everyone else was the best part from it. The ability to work as a team amongst all the health professionals and how that they all come together and bring their own unique abilities and how we can use those and the knowledge that they have to come to a plan and a goal for our patients. By learning together, they will be able to work together. If you study in silos and then suddenly on the work floor you have to work collaboratively, you have no idea what other people can contribute to the patient care. Students would be able to carry over the skills that they will learn through this program, uh, especially in terms of communication and, and collaboration, uh, and uh, they could uh, eventually trickle this into their respective careers once they graduate, with the ultimate beneficiary being the patients that they, that they serve or that they care for. I was on the program with a, another nurse in my class, uh, two pharmacists and a trainee intern doctor. Getting to know their role a bit more in depth and they're still good friends of mine today actually and so we keep in touch and sometimes um, when I have a clinical question I feel comfortable to ask them. I finished um, the IPE course um, two years ago and then yeah returned here to work at the start of last year. I think what made me want to come back to the coast was partly the fond experience that I'd had here on the IPE program. I don't think I would have considered coming here if I hadn't have, have had that experience here initially. We often think that we work well in teams, but in fact we're not doing it very well. We're creating spaces where students can safely practice working as a team.